Uh, thank you, Tashar. I'll take it from here. Uh, I am in Tarrant County where we are waiting to hear today if a shelter in place order will be announced. That order is in effect in Dallas, went into effect overnight, and it's made an already eerie station, it's already eerie situation that much more so, especially when it comes to traffic, as you alluded to, Tashara. Want to get out to Chris Sadegi, who is live at the High Five in Dallas. Now, the traffic has picked up there a little bit, but it's been a different morning than usual, Chris. Yeah, Mark, we think that morning commute will probably be a lot lighter here on 75. It is just humming right along. We'll see how that changes this morning, but it is day one of Dallas County shelter in place. It will go through April 3rd. I'm out here right now because for us in the news media, it is still one of those essential jobs listed in the order, allowed to go about their business. Joining us, still going to work. Some of those other essential jobs we have our government services like police and fire, jobs having to do with health care, food supply businesses like grocery stores are still working, child care and home maintenance services like lawn care, they, those still can operate. Pets have to survive, so the animal service businesses are working. Banks, laundromats and cemetery services are also considered essential. Restaurants do fall under food supply businesses, but they will remain takeout or delivery only. And yes, you can go outside for a little exercise and fresh air or to walk your dog, but you can't have any kind of meeting or group gathering and you must leave six feet of distance between you and anyone else. Violating any of this shelter in place order could mean a fine between 50 and $2,000 and County Judge Clay Jenkins says it will be enforced. Violate it, um, then, you know, we're, we're gonna out you, uh, we're gonna fine you, and we're going to take the steps necessary uh, to shut you down because what you're doing is not safe. Also, just to reiterate, if you need to get in the car and drive somewhere, you can still drive to the grocery store, one of those essential businesses. You can go visit a family member and you can leave the county if it is for one of those essential businesses or to go visit one of those family members. But again, you are not exempt if you work outside the county in one of those non-essential jobs. You are still expected to shelter in place. Also, something that might matter to a lot of people, the DART trains are still running. Kara, back to you. Yeah, and that's very important. Thanks, Chris.